Hi, my name is Lynn and this is the Darwin Orver channel. I love making my own tools. So today I'm going to be making a very simple yet practical tool for the shop, an awl or an ice pick. So let's get started. To make an awl, you need something sharp like a nail. I prefer stainless steel, some type of handle, and you can either make a handle on the lathe, you can shape it with a chisel or a spoke shave, or you can simply sand a handle to shape. A ferrule is nice but not necessary and you can use some copper tubing for that. And you need some epoxy to attach the nail and the ferrule to the handle. To make my handle I decided to use the lathe and I'm using a walnut blank here. Mainly I'm focusing on two parts here, the ferrule part which in order to fit the copper piping needs to be half an inch in diameter and then the knob part which you hold in your hand and which I want to be nice and round and smooth. Of course this is where you can get very creative with your design and either make a long more slender handle or a chubby one like this one. A little sanding and the handle is done. Next I'm finding the center here and using another awl to make a mark. Thereafter, drilling a hole the size of the nail I'm using. So now I have the nail here and I'm looking at how long I want it and marking where to make the cut. And I'm just using a hacksaw here. To sharpen the nail up a bit, I'm using a rasp. And next we have the ferrule. So this is half an inch copper pipe and using a pipe cutter here. So finally I have all the parts, now it's time to mix up some epoxy and glue on the ferrule and the nail. And then I'm adding a little more epoxy to fill in that extra part to make everything nice and smooth. So I'm very happy about the way this one came out. Really kind of like the shape and I made the copper ferrule a little higher and then I filled in this part with epoxy. Uh, but you could of course just make it a shorter and then sand it smooth. Otherwise thank you guys so much for watching. I'm Lynn and this is the Darwin Orver channel. Don't forget to check out my shop and my website. All the links are in the description below. And if this is your first time here, don't forget to subscribe for more content. Thanks so much for watching and I'll see you soon. Bye.